Do you know the proper technique for scanning the plantar plates in the toes? It's easy to create anisotropy or mimic pathology in the plantar plates if the proper technique is not used when imaging these structures. Here are the steps that should be used for optimal imaging of the plantar plates. First, use a lot of gel and a high frequency transducer. A linear transducer or a hockey stick may be used. Second, place the transducer on the plantar aspect of the base of each toe. Third, have the patient dorsiflex their foot so that their foot and toes are straight, but have them keep their foot relaxed enough so that you can still manipulate it manually. Four, the proximal phalanx must be straight in the ultrasound image. This can be accomplished by holding the toe straight. It is very useful to have a foot pedal to perform this exam so that you have both of your hands free. Five, once the MTP joint is visualized, heal the probe to align it with the toe and eliminate anisotropy of the plantar plate. Six, take serial consecutive images of the second through fourth plantar plates in the long axis from medial to lateral. Make small movements using the probe. Do not just angle it from medial to lateral. And number seven, image the second through fourth plantar plates in the short axis from proximal to distal. Toggle the probe upwards to make the plantar plate as echogenic as possible to eliminate the anisotropy. In this example, there was a small partial thickness tear of the third plantar plate that was not visualized until the images were optimized using proper technique. I hope this helped. Don't forget to subscribe and like the Learn MSK Sano YouTube channel.